Good morning, everyone. My name is Dennis Zmund, and I am the head of coordination of the Faces of Industrial Research 2023. On behalf of the organizing committee, it's my great pleasure to welcome you to the fifth edition of this symposium. During the past four years, this event gained its uh, popularity and recognition among the student community here in Romandy, which uh, gives evidence of the importance of our mission, which is to help to bridge the gap between academia and industry, especially from the point of view of master students, PhDs and postdocs, who are the majority in the audience here. So today we brought together 12 inspiring speakers who have one thing in common. It's their background in life sciences. However, nowadays, their, the scope of their professional activities is broad, from scientists in academia, small or big companies, to a unit head at World Health Organization or a project manager in a consulting company. Also this year you have the opportunity to discover our boots, whose representatives will present and introduce themselves in a moment. So today you will get the possibility to learn about scientific project, projects carried out in Swiss companies, to listen to interesting talks and of course to network with the speakers, booth representatives and your peers. And who are the organizers? Please let me introduce you the faces behind this event. So it's Lucie Chonviar, Olivia Maichrak, Selim Azar, Chrysanti Khampidou, Muna Hadiji, Sinka Chaushevich, who is not here now but will join later, and Alcidia Ramos Barush. I'd also like to thank our volunteers who are here today to ensure a smooth event. And if you have any questions and don't find the answer in your booklet, please don't hesitate to ask us. We wear these blue badges so you can recognize us. Um, also, some members of the organizing committee and of the volunteers are also members of Bioscience Network Lausanne, which is a student association of EPFL and UNIL. And this association is aiming at promoting uh, career development of young researchers in life sciences. And this is achieved by organizing on, or co-organizing uh, different events, such as this one or Life Science Career Day, which will take place in May, or different biotech chats. And importantly, this event can take place and be fully free of charge thanks to our sponsors, Nestle Research, Roche, Novartis, OM Pharma, ISPSO, and Biopol. We, and I believe that the students in the audience as well, are really grateful for their support and for making this event possible. So, thank you. Last thing is on the format of uh, today's event. So we will have four sessions with three speakers in each session. After the three talks, there will be a Q&A session, or we call it also panel discussion. And we decided to do so because from the experience from last year, there were many questions from the audience which were common to several speakers, especially those about uh, the career path, but there wasn't really a possibility to let them interact uh, with each other. So we decided to do this joint Q&A session afterwards. Um, but because you could forget your question for the first speaker during the talk of the second and third one, you can submit your questions online and at all time, just go to, uh, to ahaslides.com slash fear2023 or scan this QR code and you can submit your question. So it will look like this then, we will have the list of questions for the different panels. Also, please also specify if it's a specific question to one speaker or a more general one to several speakers. And you can also give likes to the questions and uh, like this, the most relevant questions will get higher. Also, I'd like to notify you that the event is recorded and that the talks and panel discussions can get published if we obtain uh, consent from, from the speakers. 
So uh, before I give, uh, I give the floor to Krisa, who will invite the brute representatives, I have the last words to say. Uh, please enjoy this day. Uh, benefit from the offered opportunities, get involved, and get inspired. Thank you. So to conclude, I'd like to thank once again to all our speakers for their inspiring talks. I believe that uh, the students here could uh, take many uh, ideas for their future career. I'd also like to thank our audience that they engaged, they submitted the questions, and we had really nice, uh, nice discussions. And so I think that's all from our side. So we invite you to the apéro, with uh, an uh, which will be accompanied by uh, an EPFL band, Diable Rabatable, which they will start to play in 15, 20 minutes probably. So enjoy in the evening and thank you.